Hi everybody, this is Oleg. Welcome to Oregon Preparedness. Nice day here in Texas. It was a little warm during the day, but now it's just perfect. About 75 degrees and a little breeze. I'm a little bit south, southeast of Dallas. Anyway, one thing for sure I love about Texas and it's gas prices. Look at that. $3.29 for gas, $4.59 for diesel, and that's not the highest. I'm not, not the, yeah, that's not the lowest. I've seen uh, I've seen lower than that, which is really good. No, uh, look at this, somebody is Somebody is uh, playing with drone. I don't know if you can see it. Very small. Ah, it's hard to see. Very hard to see. Anyway, today I really briefly wanted to talk about sort of part two to my last video. I talked about nuclear war possibilities. And um, what I wanted to mention today is something quite interesting in my opinion. One of my subscribers and commenters, she mentioned in that video, not in the video, in the comments under that video, that in her opinion, the ones who are going to drop nukes on Ukraine would be United States and then blame Russia for it and then Russia when that happens is going to get pissed off and bomb the United States and here is why I found this very interesting you know, I talked about in my last video and in many other videos about Azov Mena prophecy. I talked about Philip Barnett's prophecy about Ukraine that nukes will be dropped on it. And what's interesting, uh, in one of other interviews that I watched with him, uh, he mentioned, and I know it's hard to swallow, but he, you, can, you can find that video on the internet. And, you can uh, hear it for yourself that nukes that are going to be dropped on Ukraine are going to be American nukes and I talked about on this issue on this topic with my friend and my prepper extensively and we were trying to figure out I mean both of us we believe this prophecy is true and real but both of us were trying to figure out how come? Why American nukes will be dropped in the Ukraine when Russia is in the war with the Ukraine? And it only makes sense that Russia will nuke Ukraine. However, if you were thinking different scenarios, we thought maybe the United States would uh, drop nukes on uh, Russian forces that are in the Ukraine, so therefore it would be on Ukrainian soil, and a couple other ideas. But Once she mentioned that, my commenter, that United States is going to bomb Ukraine and then blame Russia, I immediately remember that interview with Philip Barnett when he mentioned that nukes dropped on the Ukraine will be American. Which is just crazy to think about. It is crazy. But you know what? Nothing is impossible anymore. You know, I... Back in the day when I was younger and naive, uh, I would say, oh no, that's that's just impossible. That's, that'll never happen. And uh, now, I'll say anything is possible. So I guess we'll wait and see. Well, let me know in the comments what you think. Um, but uh, it, it, it's, it's very possible in my opinion, you know, especially taking in account what Philip Barnett says so I still say I hope there will be no nuclear war that's my wish but unfortunately 
I think it's inevitable. And there's my truck, by the way. Everybody, thanks for watching. We'll see you in the next upload.